taký... What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Carlos Cooks. Um, this week, we are gonna be cooking ramen. It is 30 degrees in New York. It is freezing cold. So I thought, what more perfect time to make some really simple, to the point ramen. Today, what I'm gonna be doing is the Roy Choi version. I believe there's a YouTuber called Emmy Made in Japan who also does this recipe at home. She really likes it. I think it's a really interesting recipe and you're gonna see why. For this recipe, you wanna start with instant ramen. This is my favorite instant ramen noodle. It's Shin Ramyun. I eat this at least once a week. Don't recommend it, but it's really good instant ramen. So this is my choice of instant ramen. However, I believe you can just do whatever ramen you want. You wanna make your own broth, go for it. However, this is supposed to be a nice, very straightforward recipe. Um, so yeah, you just follow the instructions of whatever instant ramen you're using. Uh, and then you do Roy Choi's variation of said ramen. All right, let's get started. Let's do it. Soft packet, veggie packets. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna be doing two packets today. It's gonna be one for me and one for Zoe. So, the other components of this recipe are, oh god, <laughs> eggs, which we'll be cracking with two hands today, not one, and, wait for it, American <laughs> cheese. So, Roy Choi says it's delicious. I believe it. So what's your favorite instant ramen to use? Let me know, I wanna try it. Um, I always go to for Shin Ramyun, but if you have a recommendation for a ramen that you're obsessed with, please let me know in the comments below or email me. Do you want to see another ramen recipe? Also email me. Email me, please. <laughs> I need emails. <laughs> it's pouring time. I'm not sure what these veggie packets have. I'm not even gonna try and guess. <laughs> now comes the scary part. The eggs. Wow. I just sank straight into the pot. You can't even see the egg. Oh, you can see that one. So, this will take, oh god. It's like a beast. Mutating out of the... Oh, ew. The eggs are nicely poaching, so while that's happening, I'm gonna go get some serving plates. Well, we can just start getting the cheese ready. I just got the regular yellow American cheese. I didn't wanna go with Kraft. Um, I don't really eat American cheese like that. If you like Kraft, go with Kraft. I also, this comes with less. So I wanted less American cheese. Um, so Emmy Made in Japan, her channel, she puts the cheese on the bottom of the plate as opposed to the top. I'm not sure why that is. I wasn't paying that much attention to the video. I do recommend, though, you go check it out. But then Roy Choi puts it on top. And since we are following Roy Choi's recipe, the American cheese will be going on top. Ugh, look Ooh. at that beauty. Oh, the yolk's coming out. It's okay, it's okay. Yeah. Be very gentle. Nice. <laughs> it's okay, baby. Go back into the... <laughs> Push it down. It's okay, shh, 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 shh. <laughs> Cool, it's been four minutes. I'm gonna, I'd rather overcook it than undercook it. It's 10 minutes and 43 seconds. Um, I think it's time to serve this. <laughs> we can clean it up as much as you want, but in your kitchen, this is what it's gonna look like. Um, okay, cool, the cheese is starting, starting to melt. If you're interested, you just, Slice us up some spring onion. You can go ahead and do that. I don't have spring onions. I'm trying to grab it so I can kind of tilt it to you. Uh, that's okay, you know. Smells <laughs> good. Moment of truth. Yeah. The egg cooked through. 
I should go back to that video. Yeah. <laughs> Let me go back. All right, guys. That was interesting. It was definitely very interesting. I mean, foolproof, right? You have poached egg, instant ramen. How could you go wrong? The American cheese part, not that sure about. It's all tongue in cheek. It's all clowning. I'm still processing it. I don't know if it's the type of American cheese that I use. Although, like, do they really all taste that different? I don't know. If you do love American cheese, go for it. I know it's a very common thing to do, but I don't know how I feel about it with instant ramen. But hey, try new things, right? It is an interesting flavor. I would say go for this. So that's it for today's video. Thank you for tuning in. If you have any recommendations on recipes you think I should try, please jot it on the comments below. Uh, as always, the recipes will be linked in the description box below. Like, subscribe, comment if you think I did this wrong or if there was another way I should have done it. Um, if there's a recipe that you want me to try out, let me know. Hit the notification bell for videos every Tuesday and I'll see you next week. Bye. <laughs> I did like one other thing. And uh, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't sure how to end it. <laughs> I was like, that was good. Poppy from New York. LA Sun, baby. What's up? I got bounce.